Hey, what's up guys? Dami Gamer Pro here today and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you all how to get custom themes on your Nintendo 3DS or 2DS. For this video, you are going to need a computer and a modded 3DS. If you do not have a modded 3DS, I'm going to leave a link in the description below for how to mod your 3DS properly and get all the tools you need for today's video. So let's jump right into it. Alrighty guys, so after you have your 3DS completely modded and ready, you're going to head to the link in the description below, themeplaza.art, it's going to be right here, and then it's going to have a bunch of themes which you can use for your Nintendo 3DS or 2DS. So you can just scroll around, and once you find one you like, I'm going to be using this one here, the Super Mario Bros. Blue. You can just simply press the download button, and it will give you a zip file of the download. Then, all you need to do is go to your 3DS SD card, and on the root of the SD card, create a folder called Themes. If you don't already have one, you can make one, or if you already have one, just use the same one that you already have. And then in there, you can just drag and drop the zip file into right here. As you guys can see, I already have another one right here, but I'll be installing this one fresh. So you just put the zip card in here, the, not, sorry, not zip card, the zip file into here, and then you can put your SD card back into your 3DS. I will meet you guys back over there. Alright, so once you have your SD card inside of your 3DS, you're going to then want to launch Anemone 3DS Theme Manager. This, of course, will come installed if you follow the guide that I have linked in the description below. So what you want to do is just open that up. I'm just going to press A and open it up. Um, and then I'll just load it up. I'll show you guys. I'm just not going to have it on screen because of reflection um, on my camera. So, as you guys can see right here, uh, it has... Uh, the Super Mario Bros. Blue, this, which is the theme that I picked. I have another one that's already there, um, but I have this one right here. So what you're going to want to do is just hold A, don't let go of A, and then press up on the D-pad. And then you can let go of A after you've pressed up on the D-pad. As you guys can see, it has this check mark right here. Then you can just simply press the start button, and then it will give you the option to power off your 3DS. Once it does that, be sure to power off your DS, because what this is going to do is force your home menu to restart. As soon as you do that, you can power it back on, and I'm actually currently powering mine on right now. And then once it does this, you will actually be able—you will have the theme installed on your home menu, and you'll be able to see it right away. So I'm currently booting up my 3DS again, and as you guys can see here, the theme is already installed, just like that. So I'll go over to here, and as you guys can see, custom theme that I showed before. So if you guys did enjoy today's video, if you did, be sure to leave a like, comment down below what other videos you'd like to see on this channel, and stay tuned for more. Peace out.